Have you ever wondered how they create rain in films? Well, I'm here with Artem to find out. Okay, so the first thing I noticed when I came around this area is this donut looking thing. <laughs> what is it? Talk me through it. Donut looking thing. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> So when somebody phones us, usually what they'll say is, can we have a rain machine, which we laugh at, because there isn't such a thing. Yeah. The first question is where you're going to get the water from. And if you can, you get it from a fire hydrant, but sometimes you're in the middle of nowhere. So then you go back to the second option, something like this, where you put down a big collapsible tank. So right now they're pumping the water from that donut thing, the water tank. If you look at the puddle on the floor, it looks so real. It sucks the water out, it pumps it down the hose to a manifold, and then from the manifold you control the various rain stands. It's a mixture of the pressure and the nozzles you use. So you can have a light sort of misty drizzle or you can have really heavy droplets. Yeah, my favourite kind. I'm having a great time right now! <laughs> One of the things Mike told me is to get the rain stands as high as possible so that the raindrops actually come out in straight lines. Don't, for instance, put a stand either side of the camera so the rain's crossing. That's a real giveaway. <laughs> yeah. So if you can look out for that. So I'm going to give you a scenario. Yeah. If I was at home and I wanted to create rain, but I'm on a budget because my mum didn't give me enough money, what would I do? How would I create rain? Uh, well, I mean, a garden hose is, is a source of water and you just need to try and get as much pressure as you can. And, then, and if you've got a nozzle, you know, and then you adjust it to the right sort of spread, you can fire it up in the air at roughly 45 degrees so that it falls down in the area you're filming in, then, then that's perfectly acceptable. And in fact, if we're doing rain in the studio, we tend to use rain nozzles you know, from a garden sprinkler system. Stop. I've got the power right now. <laughs> right now, they're laying down some snow. Oh, it's really exciting. <laughs> so this is what I've just made with my bare hands. Well, not really, but you know, it looks really cool and foggy. I can't really see much. 